Alright guys, today I'm going to show you how to sketch the graph of f of x equals x squared plus 4x, finding the vertex, axis of symmetry, and all intercepts. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take negative x squared plus 4x and break it apart. You can factor out a negative and an x. So it's going to look like negative x times x minus 4. And it's the same exact thing as this. It's just easier to find your x-intercepts. So what you're going to do is you're going to take this first one, set it equal to zero, and your second one, and set it equal to zero. And that's how you find both your intercepts. So you get x equals four, you just add four. And negative x equals zero is the same as x equals zero. So your x-intercepts are zero, zero, and four, zero. Now to move on to your y uh, intercepts, you're uh, plugging in zero for the x's so you, to find your y intercepts. You can use the original or you can use a broken apart one for this. So I'm just going to use the original, negative zero plus four times zero, so f of x equals zero, negative zero squared that is. So then your y intercept is 0, 0. To find your vertex, it's h comma k. h equals the opposite of b over 2a, and k equals f of h. So basically, to find those, opposite of b over 2a, so go back to the original, the opposite of 4 over 2 times negative 1. The opposite of 4 over 2 times negative 1 is the same as negative 4 over negative 2, which is equal to 2. So that's the first part. That's how you find h. To find k, you just plug it in. So f of 2 equals negative 2 squared plus 4 times 2. So 2 squared is 4, so negative 4 plus 8. 4 times 2 is 8, and that gives you 4. So the other part is 4. To find the axis of symmetry, it's always x equals this number. So in this case, x equals 2. So now that we have all the answers that we need to graph it, we're going to sketch the graph. First thing, we'll go look at the x-axis. 0, 0 is our first point, and 4, 0 is the second so that's where it's going to touch on the x-axis. We know it opens downward because it's negative. So then we'll graph the vertex, which is 2, 4. So 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4 up here. The axis of symmetry goes down like this. And there you go. That's it.